myself I wasn't gonna do it, man. I told myself I wasn't gonna do it. I freaking I made a decision after jiggies of time. I wasn't gonna do it. Uh, here we go. All right, folks, welcome to the new Let's Play series. <laughs> We're playing Banjo Tooie. Um, I know it's been less than a year since I played uh, Jiggies of Time. If you haven't seen that, uh, go check it out. Um, it's one of the first uh, Let's Play series that I ever did. Um, following Jiggies of Time, I told myself I wouldn't be touching Banjo Kazooie or Banjo Tooie for a super long time because Jiggies of Time kind of frustrated me to no end. But I guess I'm going back on my word. <laughs> Here we are, <laughs> about to play Banjo Tooie all the way through. Um, this is going to be a revisit playthrough for me. Um, I picked Banjo Tooie specifically because I prefer that over Banjo Kazooie. Uh, this was the first game or first Banjo Kazooie game that I ever played. So this one holds a super special place in my heart. Um, I haven't played it in well over 15 years, so it's it's going to be it's going to be interesting. Um, another reason we're playing Banjo Tooie is because this was suggested by a user named Ninten Larry X, uh, who I guess has been watching the show. <laughs> he uh, sent in a request, and I don't have a lot of requests so far. So I would like to encourage y'all to reach out to this email address that I'm going to put up on the screen here. And just send me, if you have a suggestion for an old game uh, that you would like to see played on the channel, um, we can certainly consider it if you if you send us that suggestion via the email uh, in the link. And I'll put the email in the uh, description too, uh, just so it'll be there. But um, yeah, the only thing that I want to say about that is um, pretty much any old game is up for up for playing on the channel. Um, I do have a limit as to what we will, we can play on the channel. Uh, since this is considered a, a retro game channel, I'm trying to limit um, where the line is as far as like what you consider retro. At the moment of this recording, I am considering anything Xbox, original Xbox, I mean, uh, PlayStation 2 and GameCube era and before. I believe that's Generation 6. So anything at that generation and before is free game for the channel. So yeah, if you have a suggestion, feel free to send an email to the email address I'm going to provide um, in the description below. And yeah, with that said, let's start Banjo Tooie. Yeah, yeah, my boy Banjo. Here we go. <laughs> oh, it was a cold and stormy night. The rain looked like white lines falling from the sky. Two years have passed since Gruntilda the Witch was defeated by Banjo and Kazooie. Oh shit. <laughs> After falling from her tower, she was buried underground where she remains until this very day. <clears throat> until some green idiot <laughs> came and woke her up. <laughs> no good, mistress. Still can't shift rock. <laughs> <laughs> He's so funny looking. All because of that stupid bear. What about the bird? The sassy bird. She had a hand in that too. Oh man. There they are! And Mumbo! Mumbo's my favorite. Mumbo's my favorite character in this series. Mumbo play well. I missed what else he said. Well, he's right, Kazooie. There goes your bird seed money. Don't be so sure, Banjo. Hey, look outside, everyone. Granny the Witch is coming. <laughs> what? <laughs> Just, oh, hey, there's Granny the Witch. She's coming. Oh, where, where, Kazooie? Oh, I can't see her. Oh, er, uh, false alarm. Uh, bottles. Must have been some, uh, shadows, you know. I forgot how slowly the text rolls on this. It's kind of annoying when I'm trying to read it. Let's play. I feel lucky. Do you feel lucky, punk? The frame rate's kind of choppy. I apologize. Um, I did try to correct that. But apparently this is just how the game runs. There's some things you can do to tweak it. But uh, the more I was diving into that, the less sense it made. It was also fucking up other things, so I'm just going to leave it as is. The other option I had was to get the remastered version, 
uh, for Xbox, but I don't have a physical Xbox. And I mean, that's a remaster and this is the original. So, I mean, I'd rather do this. <laughs> I'll stop rocking the table. Make it be sick. Mumbo not rocking table. Whole house shakes. Lots. The perhaps one of us uh, should uh, go take a look outside. God, it's it's. My brain works too quickly for the text. It's it's kind of driving me nuts. Look at that big old boy. Just the tip. Yeah, aren't these like the Grunty Sisters or something? Which I think did not exist until Banjo Tooie. Like, what? You killed our sister? Fucking bitch. Why would you do such a thing? Oh man. It's full of farts. They've been farting up a storm in there. Oh, it's the skinny one. I totally forgot about these witches. <laughs> hmm. Hurry, Blah Belda. Our sister is waiting. <laughs> Blah Belda. <laughs> oh, jeez. Uh, quickly, we must go, or Angry Grunty will be... Then get off of me, you must! Or move, I cannot! I forgot they always speak in, like, rhymes and riddles and shit. <laughs> Let's stop now, I wonder what it was. Sure was noisy. Let's go take a look, Kazooie. But, but it's it's dark out there, and uh, uh, I'll be scared. Mumbo, much brave. Me go look outside. Back in minute. <laughs> I love Mumbo so much. <laughs> what a sucker, huh? Come on, Banjo. Give me a hand. <laughs> Kazooie, don't do that. You piece of shit. We can't take you anywhere. Mumbo looks so angry. <laughs> Sorry, mistress. <laughs> I have failed you. Worry, Grunty mustn't. Get out your sister's will. Big Rock is so powers, we must combine. Big Rock is. <laughs> That's how I should have said it. Grunty, you should not mock. Now watch our magic blast this rock. Boulder Blaster. BK Brew. What is that? No, man. And just like that, the rock is gone. Gone Rock has so out you can come. Nice panties. Oh, jeez. She's got like a... Oh, I thought she had like a fro going on, kind of. She's a skelly. A skelly wag. No, 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 this cannot be. What's happened to little old me? Nice granty looks. Lost weight you have. I'm trying to decide voices on these people, <laughs> so it's going to change a bit while I'm doing it. Can you help with this little deed? Yes, plan to help we have. So back to our castle we must go. Right, right. Then, uh, girls, let's fix me up. Then Banjo's hairy butt, I'll whoop. I don't think that worked right. This not good. Me go tell Banjo. Arr, seen us, bony man has. Him we must whack. That didn't rhyme. <laughs> that totally didn't rhyme. Now leave it to me. He's no hassle. I'll kick butt. Then off to the castle. Oh shit. Run, Mumbo, run. <laughs> I love the music in this game. Banjo to e our banjo kazooie music is this is amazing. Guess I'll be having that bird seed after all, huh, banjo? Well, you cheated, kazooie. 
That's not... Oh, shit. Everyone. Gasp. Must run. <laughs> Pant. Quick. Grunty. Coming. I wish I could see all the text at once. I, I'm, I'm not gonna try and, like, emphasize the voice acting in this as much. I know I do that a lot on these series, but... Let's see that furry fool dodge this! Man, this is a lot longer than I remember. <laughs> yeah, yeah, Skull Boy, and I bet she had two... something. I missed it. No, joke, look, pant, spell, coming, pant, wheeze. Please right. Quick, everyone out! I'm not falling for that trick again. I'm staying right here. Oh, and then he dies, I think. <laughs> yeah, he gets fucking annihilated. And then he's just a ghost for the rest of the game. Well, our work is done here. Hurry, you must. Ready to leave we are. Hold on, sis. I'm nearly there. I've just been to blast that bear. What? Well, what? Troops people to... Oh. How... How did they all fit in there? That didn't make any sense. It's a cartoon game, I know. <laughs> but, whatever. They leave me with all these fools? Alright, I'm ready to play. Stop, wait for me, mistress. Grunty. No, no, Klungo. You stay here. I'll be back. Have no fear. Oh, and now everything's nice and pristine. Nice little sun effect there. Pretty intense for an N64 game. Well, my house is ruined. Groan. Mumbo's head hurts. Look at our house! Well, at least everyone got out safely. I think... I don't know. I feel like Banjo should have like a... Like a proper voice. I think that makes it funny. Oh, poor bottles. It kind of freaked me out when I was little that he just dies. Oh, Mo looks much unwell. It's worse than that. Grunty's killed poor Bottles. He wasn't the favorite character in Banjo-Kazooie, anyway. <laughs> That's mean. Kazooie? Sorry. Grunty wreck house and kill Bottles. She must pay. Bear and bird get after which Mumbo see you later. <laughs> Great, I get to peck some more witch butt. Let's go, Banjo. Uh, I have a feeling it's not going to be so easy this time. Jeez, yeah. It takes way longer to get through that cinematic than I remember. Like half the episode. Alright, nice. There's, here's his body. R.I.P. Bottles. Hello, Ghost of Bottles. How do I talk to him? There we go. Oh no, various insects are taking an interest in my corpse. I mean, it's not like you're gonna use it anymore. Can I not talk to him? I thought I could. Yeah, no, I guess that's it. Can I go back into the house? See the destruction? A little bit? You can. Banjo's house. What's left of it, at least. Yeah, there's, I don't think there's really any point to being in here. It's kind of interesting that they included it, though. Just in case you wanted to go... ...check out the ruined house. Yeah. I like this game more than Banjo-Kazooie. Uh, I think I've already stated that, but one of the main reasons is that, uh... ...you get to explore the actual world... ...instead of being stuck in Grunty's castle. The Banjo-Kazooie world is kind of... ...kind of interesting to me. 
Oh, there he is. Gonna go beat his ass. He's the first boss, I believe. Uh, 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 stupid bear and bird coming. Me wait for them in here. <laughs> I'm gonna run away. I could just go whoop their ass now, but why do that? Which ability would you- I don't know. Here. No, damn it. Skip. There we go. I'm pretty familiar with this already. Just because, again, I, I played through Jiggies of Time. Try using eggs as ammo. Oh, well, maybe not. Ah, just run into him. Here we go. Give me that. Yeah, honeycomb. Hello. No, I don't care. I know that the uh, mo the the mounds of dirt later. Oh wait, no, it's not the mounds of dirt. Um, it's like these little. Little capsules that you get upgrades in. This dude who's talking right now, he teaches you shit. <laughs> I love his voice. Hut, hut, ho, hup, hup, ho. That dude's a little, or uh, it used to be a little bit of an inside joke between me and my brother. We would just start doing that. When we were very little, I bet if I brought it up to him now, he wouldn't really remember what I was talking about. Uh, when there's some running shoes and some green boots. Oh, oops. Do I need the running shoes for anything? Oh, maybe I'd jump over here with them. Oh, shit. Wait, what's with the Kazooie thing? I don't remember what you have to do with that at all. There's fucking Jinjos, though. I heard that. Do you actually collect things here, or is it... I thought this was just like an introductory area. I don't know. Let's go ahead and just <laughs> go follow the, the boss man over here. Yeah, I guess you just dive right into it. Inside the digger tunnel. Yeah, I think I do remember that. You just go straight to this guy. You don't really do anything out in the beginning. Uh, the, the first area. Klungo, minion with a mission. <laughs> if it isn't the Baron Bird who caused so much trouble to Mistress Grunty- Oh, I can skip ahead in the dialogue now. Oh, I don't remember anything like that happening. Uh, uh you stupid. At least we could speak properly. The uh, uh, Klungo is mad now. Your game ends here. <laughs> oh yeah, he has like potions. And he eats the glass. Okay. Yo, oh, now Klungo squash. Oh god. Um, I don't remember how to fight this dude. What do I do? I think I just run into- Oh, I have to wait for him to- Oh, wait. Potion wear out. Shit. Clever Klungo hide behind magic shield. Now show bear my special potion. I remember this part. Yeah, I can't hit him with the shield. I guess I just hit him when he's big, like that? I don't remember this guy at all. I mean, like, his mechanics. Yeah, I guess that's it. I just keep hitting him. Yep. Alright, well, <laughs> we did it. Go us. Nasty Baron Bird hurts poor Klungo. You asked for it, pal. Why don't you run off and we'll forget this ever happened? You're a good idea, but you're not seen last of Klungo. <laughs> Klungo coming, mistress. Please beat failure Klungo with broomstick.
I like that shit. <laughs> Alright. Pick these up, even though we don't need them. And we will continue onward. My controller's kind of making him go to the right slightly. I might need to recalibrate this thing. But I'll do that later. It's not that big of a deal. It's not really fucking me up too much. This is the wrong way. This is the way we came from. Oh, wait. No, it's not. What the fuck? What? Can I not go back to the the cave? I just walk through the cave? I guess so. That's kind of weird. I vaguely remember that, though. I remember being confused by that when I was little, too. I just had, like, a weird deja vu. <laughs> Alright, but this is Isla Hag's Jinjo Village. This is one of my favorite places in the game. And then here's old... what's his face? This is one of my silos! Open up some more to create a network of shortcut tunnels! Can I just jump into it? No. Not yet, punk! You'll need to open another silo before you can use a shortcut. Oh, this place is fucked up. It's been destroyed. What does this say? This is an information signpost! Press B when next to 1 to read it! Okay. In loving memory of the Grey Jinjo family, passed away unexpectedly when a huge digging machine flattened their house. Just a couple minutes ago. <laughs> oh yeah, I wasn't even paying attention, but there's like, tracks from the drill. Going everywhere. See, so yeah, if I remember correctly, you find Jinjos... ...throughout the game, and then they appear here. Uh-oh. Oh, there we go. Fuck, I thought there was something wrong. This is my palace, not bad, eh? Just come on in and see the ginster. Is that what you call yourself? Okay, let's go. Let's, let's go visit the dude. I think he's, uh... I don't know if it's at the beginning of the game or later on, but he becomes like a fucking zombie. Gold feathers are used for invulnerability. God, I love, this is so nostalgic for me. I love this. Spent so many hours playing this game when I was little. It was at one time one of my favorite N64 games. Now I'm older and I know better. <laughs> King Jingling's throne room. Yeah, I guess he's not a zombie yet. What is that little fucking thing he has? Is it supposed to be cute? Yo, what's up? I'm King Jingling, king of all things Jinjo and ruler of this village. Your kingdom seems a bit, uh, empty. My people were scared away by those witches and their giant machine. I kind of like it, Quiet, but I need to get them all back to the, uh, for the kickball tournament next week. Doesn't it seem that important to me? But it is! There's a big kickball rivalry between the Jinjos and the Moles, which means there could be trouble if we don't turn up. Oh dear. <laughs> exactly! I thought the same thing! Anyway, here's an incentive for you to rescue my people. A Jiggy. What is the actual utility of Jiggies in this universe? I, don't, I never really understood that. I believe you should go and see Master Jiggy Wiggy in his temple now. Uh, Jiggy who? <laughs> Jiggy Wiggy, he's the leader of a secret and ancient order dedicated to the mystical powers of the Crystal Jiggy, duh! <laughs> ancient order? Crystal Jiggy? You just made that up, didn't you? No, honest. It's all true. He's very important to your adventure, as only the Crystal Jiggy can open the worlds that you must enter. Uh, can you show us the way, King Dingling? <laughs> It'll be my pleasure, Banjo. Let's just freeze so we can load this other section of the game, real quick. Bottle's house. I remember that. And off we go. Some brilliant camera work going on.
Not bad for a king, huh? Yeah, his strange pet thingy was cool. Let's go and find that Jimmy Wiggy then. <laughs> Alright, let me play. Oh, meanwhile, at the Legion of Doom! Okay, we get it, it's a tower. Oh, whoa, shit. She's fucking packing, dude. She's supposed to be a witch. She's got all this, like, giant guns and shit. Like, fuck magic. Magic only gets you so far. Now a cannon. A cannon scares everybody. Come on, sisters. I like... What is, play, oh, I missed it completely. Jeez. I know that you're rhyming is, so stop it or we will not tell. No! If I must. B.O.B. This is Big Old Blaster, built by Mingy and me. Life force from ground, plants and creatures. It can suck. Start in the big tank, the force is. Shower Grunty will... Shower Grunty... What the fuck? The tank fold and the new body will have. I'm having such a hard time reading this, dude. Holy hell. An evil and heartless plan. I like it. How long will it take to suck up enough life force? Not slip you are, so plenty will be needed. Are you calling me fat? Yes, uh, we are calling you fat. Patient you must be. Target you first must pick. Huh. That cursed jingling has just given the furry fool a jiggy. I reckon we should blast the Jinjo King. Auto-targeting B.O.B. has <laughs> button you only have to press. <laughs> Suck. Blow. <laughs> they did that on purpose. He's the same people who made Conquer. I mean, which, by the way, I've never played Conquer. Uh, that's up for grabs on the channel. If anybody wants to suggest that, we begin the firing sequence. Oh yeah, he fucking hits the king. That, that's how he turns into a zombie. It's a lot of death in this fucking game. Target B.O.B. has hit. Steal life force, he will. Unlucky B.O.B. was bare. We just missed. Oh, it even sucks the color out. <laughs> Never mind him. What about that traitor? Jingling. Traitor. All right, can I play now? Oh, there he is. Dude, yeah, he used to freak me out when I was little. I hated going back in here. Ha <laughs> ha He's just a zombie now! Successful B.O.B. was Jiggling's life force we have. Right then, girls, let's blast the whole island! This we can do, but big charge up B.O.B. will need... Hours it will take, and it revenge bear will seek. Pa! I wouldn't worry. Banjo's got no one to help him now that Mole and Jingling are gone. He'll never get to us in time. <laughs> it's so frustrating trying to read the, the text in this game. One of the reasons why I didn't want to do this. <laughs> Bottles house. Wait, I want to go see King Jingling. In his zombie glory. Oh, the music changed. Yeah, look at his fucking creepy ass. Zombified throne room. Can I attack him? Oh. I guess not. I, I can attack him, but I don't think I can kill him. Yeah, <laughs> whatever. 
Oh, and they killed the poor little whatever it was. Old King Cole? Oh yeah, he's a right one. <laughs> what? What? It, what does that mean? Whatever. We're getting out of here. Isle of Hags, Jinjo Village. All right, yeah, let's go to Bottle's house. Time to get this show on the road. There's so much introduction to this game, I forgot about it. Wait, is there something else in here? No. Hello, your dad's dead. Your husband has died. Oh, hello, Banjo. How are we today? Pretty good, miss. Bottles and yourself? Oh, fine, fine. Tell her about Ghosty Boy. Keep quiet, Kazooie. What was that? Is Bottles okay? He should be back from Spiral Mountain for his dinner soon. He never misses his dinner. You know. Uh, I'm, I'm sure he'll be back soon, Miss B. Aw. Don't be a dick. Tell her the truth. Where's his son? Wasn't his son here? I think he's in here. No? Wait, what the fuck? You got monsters in your house, Miss B. What the fuck? You can't just have monsters in your house? It's kind of weird that there was just like one monster. Yeah, where's where's his son? Is he over here? Oh, there's like a lot of fucking ways to go in here. There he is. What up, son? Hey there, Banjo. Hi, Specky. Me and my dad are going to be playing in the kickball tournament next week over at the Mayan Stadium. King Jingling has organized it especially for my dad, since he's such a hero. Uh, I don't suppose you have any substitutes? Why would we need a substitute? My dad is the best on the team. I'm sure he was, or is. And did you know that tunnel over there is my secret way out of the village? You might find it useful. We already know that. King Dingling is a personal friend of ours. He opened it up especially for us. Nice. <laughs> okay. Uh, there was another way to go over here. I wanted to check it out real quick. Hey. Oh, he's got another. He's got two children. Hey, yo, Banjo. Hi, Goggles. Since you and Daddy are such good friends, I'll give you these prototype glasses he was working on. Did he finish working on them by any chance? Oh, yes, I believe they're called uh, the Amazo Gaze glasses. How do they work? Well, when Banjo's eyes view, use Blair and Blair to zoom in and out. Not bad. Oh, did I actually get something with that? Oh, I can. I can zoom in and out. That's cool. I don't remember that. <laughs> From the beginning. Wait, what's this poster real quick? Um, I'm not a super huge... What do you call it? Uh, rare fan? So I don't know who that is or what that is. Somebody let me know in the comments. If you feel inclined. But yeah, well, let's go over here. I think this is like... The little crossroads area, I think, if I remember correctly. Wooded Hollow. Yeah, that's... Well, no, not really, but... I am Jiggy Wiggy, and this is my temple. If you want to see me, you'll need to get past my doorman first. Who has a Jiggy for a face. Don't make fun of him. <laughs> Alright, I, I think that's going to be enough for this uh, first episode of Banjo-Tooie. Again, uh, if you have any suggestions for uh, playthroughs in the future, please uh, send a email to the email address on the screen. <laughs> And we will totally consider uh, whatever you suggest. <laughs> but yeah, thanks for watching, y'all. Like and comment on this video and subscribe for more Banjo-Tooie in the coming days. And I will see y'all later. Goodbye!